Hello and welcome back to my channel everyone, Tip Benson here and you have found yourself in the place to be to help you find fragrances that you love. In today's video, we're gonna talk about my top 10 best fragrances for men. This will be designer edition. Almost got tripped up there. I was gonna talk about the niche, but no, we're talking about designers today. I have some fabulous picks picked out for you, so I can't wait to share it with you. If you enjoy these types of videos, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and let's get started. I would love if you would leave a comment and let me know what fragrances you've been wearing this fall so far. It's been a minute since we've communicated in this way, so let your girl know what you've been wearing down below in the comments. Let's start off the countdown with one of my favorites. It's been my favorite for many many years here we have Paco Rabanne 1 million lucky now if you haven't seen my review on this fragrance and you need to go check it out I will link it in the cards this is a sweet woody and nutty fragrance heavy on the sweet it has notes of plum grapefruit bergamot hazelnut patchouli oak moss and vetiver and amber wood in the base intentionally woody and nutty it's a little bit of humor from the house of Paco Rabanne but honestly all in all this is a beautiful scent I love this one for date night close encounters it smells amazing has great sillage women seem to love it I'm one of them and I'm highly recommending this one for fall Ooh, another favorite of mine it makes my countdown every year I mean sometimes fragrances they just can't do any wrong oldie but goodie but goodie nonetheless this is Versace Eros and gotta love that detail the packaging is just superb this fragrance came out in 2012 it's been out for a long time think about it 10 years right we're in 2022 it's a fresh vanilla scent with notes of mint green apple lemon tonka bean and broxen geranium vanilla cedar love this vanilla cedar dry down it is so so good i tell the story all the time i smelled this on many men but <laughs> the day i smelled this on my brother my brother of all people it turned my head and i was like let me take a second look at this fragrance because this smells so so good lots of sillage tons of presence um it's masculine and sexy and it can also be quite powerful it is amazing and i love this one for fall i always recommend it to my guys out there love it another fragrance that i'm always recommending to my guys out there probably one of my number one recommendations for men to have in their wardrobe is this scent right here this is bleu de chanel parfum adore this fragrance oh my gosh it is so 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 good it's citrusy and it's woody and it's clean and it's fresh. This version is a little bit more niche leaning. It just smells a little bit more refined, not as mass appealing as most designer fragrances are. Love this one for the office, love it for date night, love it for going out, brunch, lunch, dinner. I mean, you can wear it anywhere, any occasion. This fragrance can really do any, no wrong. And it's a wonderful staple to have in a collection. Highly recommending this one for fall and really all seasons. It's perfection. While we're in that blue genre, we're just gonna keep going with it. This is one that I also recommend year after year. And every time I smell this on a man, I'm just overly impressed with it because it is iconic. Probably one of the most iconic fragrances coming out of the house of Dior. This is Sauvage. Love the sprayer. Do you see that? The pressurized sprayer. We love that. So this one has fresh and spicy notes of bergamot, pepper, lavender, Szechuan pepper, pink pepper, vetiver, patchouli, and broxen and cedar and labdanum in the base. It's iconic. So this is probably one of the more popular scents, the most popular fragrance on this list. So many men wear this and know about this fragrance, but it, to me, it's like all in how you rock it. You know, like this is wonderful. I love smelling this in the cooler weather it just has such a presence about it and it's citrusy and spicy and also fresh and clean but it has a little bit of a bad boy edge to it almost smells like gasoline sometimes I know that's an odd thing to say about a fragrance but that's what it reminds me of anyway I am recommending it for fall I think it's beautiful and it is a great choice to have in your arsenal why not since we're talking about freshies right <laughs> might as well continue with 
with that genre in this category. This is from our friends at Bulgari and this is Bulgari Man Glacial Essence. What I love about this fragrance is that this is a fresh fragrance, but it's not like fresh and bright and summery and like cheerful. This is more of a cold, wintry, fresh fragrance that's super clean and just very polished and elegant. I adore it. It has notes of juniper berries, ginger, geranium, sandalwood, orris root, clear wood, musk, and cedar. So ultimately what you're getting here, at least on my skin, is ginger, musk, and cedar, and even a bit of juniper berries at the top. Freshy for sure, but a cold freshy. If you haven't tried this one, I highly recommend you getting your hands on it. It's definitely worth a smell, especially Especially if you love clean fresh scents. Up next something very quite new but new for the countdown for sure. This is from MCM and it's MCM at a parfum. It's a fruity floral fragrance. It's a little bit sweet and fresh. We have notes here of raspberry, apricot, so those juicy fruity notes for my guys out there who love fruity notes. This has a lot of fruit. There's also peony, violet leaf, jasmine, and broxen, sandalwood, moss, and vanilla. Gorgeous dry down. It's quite sweet and green. It's like something about that moss and vanilla note combined together. But I also really enjoy the opening of this with the apricot that's so juicy and raspberry that kind of just makes my mouth water. This type of fragrance, I would describe it as a fruity, freshy, but also since it has that that vanilla and broxen base. It's giving me very fall. I love this scent. You should definitely try this out. For my guys out there who are looking for something that's more on the cleaner side, something that makes you feel like you've just gotten out of the shower, this chef's kiss. I think you will love that one a lot. This one is a special one. Um, I got an opportunity to experience this particular fragrance because I was working with the Fragrance Foundation and really they sent me this scent and put me on totally. So now that I have it in my collection, I wanted to share it with you because this is a gem of a fragrance. It's from Toomey. It's called Continuum. It came out in 2021. This is an ambery, powdery, musky tobacco scent. It has notes of amber, alibinum, green mandarin, tobacco leaf, orris root, suede, musk, and oud, a wearable oud. Sometimes I wear this and I feel like it smells like a cinnamon bun or a cinnamon biscuit on the skin. And other times I wear this and I'm just getting all tobacco leaf. This kind of reminds me of another fragrance. It's in the same vein, but they're completely different fragrances. Tom Ford's Tobacco Vanille, similar vibe, two different fragrances, but similar vibe for sure. If you like more richer, deeper, darker, more complex fragrances, you need to have this one in your collection. Definitely give it a try. It's a stunner. It's a sleeper slash stunner. Up next is a fragrance that I always mention every year on the countdown. This is Wanted by Night from the House of Azaro. Now this one, it's super sexy. It's giving very mature, but not too mature. Um, I love this one for date night, close encounters, moments where you want to be noticed. It has notes of cinnamon, mandarin orange, lavender, fruity notes, incense, red cedar, cumin, tobacco, vanilla, leather, cedar, benzoin, isoe super, patchouli. There's a lot going on in this fragrance, but it's so, so worth it. Prominent notes here are leather, benzoin for sure, incense, tobacco, even that vanilla is just super sweet and very, very sexy. You know, this is definitely giving a man who wants to be noticed for all the right reasons. And that's why I always include it on my fall countdown. It's a stunner. You will love it. Up next, we have another fragrance that I always gush about and I always rave about this one. This is Y from Yves Saint Laurent. Love this scent. It's a woody aromatic fragrance with notes of apple, ginger, bergamot, sage, juniper berries, amber wood, tonka bean, cedar, vetiver, 
Ugh, this is just such a gorgeous scent. The apple up top, the ginger. Oh, it's just so, so pretty and fresh and sexy, even seductive. Has a lovely dry down. This has a great presence to it. It kind of gives like party vibes, like guys that just want to have fun, like that cool dude sort of aroma. Anyway, I love this for fall. This smells amazing in the colder weather. It also smells great in hot weather too, but this smells so good once the cooler weather hits. You will love that one for fall for sure. Last but certainly not least is a fragrance that I've had for quite some time and every year this is kind of like a nostalgic fragrance for me. This was released in 2011 so it's had some wear and tear on it but it's still one of my babies. This is Mont Blanc Legend and yeah. It is a legend, a legend for sure. It's a sweet vanilla-y herbal fragrance. It has notes of lavender, pineapple, bergamot, lemon, apple, dried fruits. Dried fruits always gives fall fragrance weather to me. Oak moss rose sandalwood tonka bean this to me just smells like a sophisticated gentleman it's more mature leaning this is definitely not for everyone especially now since it's you know it's got some years on it but it's worth a try especially if you love warmer richer more elevated fragrances and this one is quite affordable as well so definitely give this one a try if that sounds like your jam. So, did you enjoy this video? If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up right now. The conversation continues over in the Fragrance Society. I will leave a link in the description for you to join in on the conversation. Each week, we deliver an email straight to your inbox so that you can stay in the know of all things fragrance and keep your fragrance game on point. So, join the community. I will link it down in the description below. I love you forever. Don't forget to watch what's up next. Definitely share this video with a friend if they love fragrance and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.